Hi uh, everyone, uh, in continuation to the DP2 uh, practical tutorial, so today I'm going to talk about the SQL functions on DB2. SQL functions on DB2 are categorized, uh, there are many uh, functions that can be used, so today I'm going to cover only the below four functions, that is a numeric function, string function, date function, and the group functions, and how do we use it. So when I, so when I talk about the numeric functions, these are like absolute, ABS stands for absolute value. It gives you the absolute value of a specified feed or in column. So square root, if you specify any constant value, it's going to provide the square root uh, mod. Uh, it's going to go give provide you the mod value based on the two inputs you provide. So exponential value, 2 power 3, 8, 3 power 3, 97. So those kind of expression values it's going to provide power. Uh, uh, sorry, the power is about uh, 2 power 3 and the expo exponential value e power something what squared could be the value. So rounded value if you want to give the sum get some round value. So round 60.85 it will be like 61. So in this way you can uh, have a numeric functions. You can use this numeric functions while working with either a application program, db2 application program or practicing an SQL query. So next we have a string functions. Uh, these string functions are very much used during a report creation when you're trying to report, create a report or trying to pass a value from one table to another table or from load it from uh, either from uh, to a VSAM file or from VSAM file to a DB2 tables. Okay. So these are very much used. Uh, first is a lowercase, uppercase, init cap, lower in the case all the selected string will print in a lowercase uh, uppercase with selected string will print in an uppercase even though a particular string has particular record has an either lowercase or an uppercase in it cap so first it will print uh, the first character as a capital and the next with the lowercase left trim so if in, in a selected field if you have any spaces so it's going to trim and it's going to show you the result substring selecting a specific uh, string values from a uh, entire feed concatenate is going to merge two different feeds Okay, and string and so on. So let's connect to the system and see how it will work. Okay. So as I said, select upper of employee name from EMP underscore table one. Okay. So when I run this query is being displayed. So it's taking some time. So F2. Just wait for a moment. Sometimes retrieving the data might take some time. Okay, query displayed. It seems to be some problem with uh, the internet connection. Okay. Yeah, it seems to be some problem with the internet.